Okotoks has always had a reputation of a historic past, a sustainable future. So we've had a big goal here to be a leader in environmental responsibility for well over a decade. And so always wanting to increase and look at solar energy is one of our top priorities. Last year we applied for the Alberta Municipal Solar Program in order to put solar on the roofs of our brand new eco centre and our fleet building. And the intent for those buildings is always to support solar. The roofs were built solar ready and because it's a centre point for all operations in Okotoks, it was a priority for us to get solar on there. When the AMSP program came out, we realised that we could maximise the amount of solar production on those roofs and have it subsidised. In order to reduce our footprint from our fleet vehicles and be able to access some of the off-road areas for our enforcement services, we applied through the electric vehicle program and we received a subsidy for an off-road electric vehicle for our enforcement to go check out parks and things like that. Our economy is important and it operates within a social structure which operates within an environmental structure. So you need to make sure that the economics and the social and the environment are all tied in to any project you do and to do that you need to do a holistic evaluation of each project. When times are tight, it's really hard to think about working for the future when you're worrying about what's happening tomorrow. However, the people in Okotoks have historically supported sustainable future, which is partly why our tagline is historic past sustainable future. And I think that the discourse around in the community has people maintaining a high quality of life and they want it to be here for a very long time, which is what sustainability is all about.